Hello, good morning. This is another episode of Techno Blob, and we're coming to you here live from the awesomeness. Uh, with me is Iben Wilkins, and we're gonna have another awesome episode. What are we talking about today, Iben? Yeah, today we're gonna just run down some of the tech news that was released during the past weekend. All right, so we're gonna jump in this thing. Are you ready? Let's go. <laughs> Alright, so the first up is the Lenovo Yoga A12. Um, it's a new iteration of a laptop from Lenovo running Android. Some of the details are 12.2 inch touchscreen, resolution of 1200 by 800 pixel, Intel Atom Cherry Trail, backlit touch input keyboard, Android 6.0.1. 32 gigabytes of storage and 2 gigabytes of RAM. All right, so we have another outlier from Lenovo. Lenovo is being a trailblazer in the sense where they are not afraid to experiment with yeah. new designs, push boundaries, and I must commend them for this um, initiative. Uh, it might not be popular, it might right. not work, but at least being able to step out of your comfort zone and experiment with something. Yeah, and what Maurice is talking about is that the fact that it's an Android operating system on a laptop and it has a touch keyboard. It's not the standard type keyboard, it's a touch keyboard. Yes, it is it is cool. It's really yeah. cool. Yeah. Um it looks really sleek. Too. Yeah. Uh, uh, Lenovo was responsible for really pushing the idea of this tent design and yeah swivel on screen yeah. and so on so you see them also try now to shake off that comfort in their um, watch band design and say okay let me try something new let me try something different and let me see if we can do something more innovative and they must be commended um how successful this product will be i am not sure typing on glass is a chore yeah for productivity um, so I don't know if it will be successful, but it's, it will come in there for it. Yeah. So anything else for a bit? Yeah, next on the list is the Windows 10 Cloud. Yes. Yeah. This is a new leak that was published online, sure it's showcasing um, a new Windows 10. Um, this Windows 10 is going to restrict users to only be using apps found on Windows Store. It's very similar to Windows RT, if any of you remember RT. Yes. Yeah. Alright, so let me jump in here. Let me be as short as possible. We need to keep this video below you know, five, <laughs> five minutes. It's a tricky situation for Microsoft because there's an expectation when you install Windows, you can install whatever you want. So to convince users that they are all now locked into the Windows Store is going to be tri quite tricky. That expectation does not come attached to Chrome OS. So that situation is where they're going to have some problems. I would want to see if they will, at, at this second try, because RT failed, if they will actually have that convincing power. The Windows Store is now up 600,000 apps. I don't know if that's going to be enough to keep people in that wall garden. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah, we'll see. So what's next? So next up we have the rumored HTC 11 smartphone. Yes. Yes, this is the upgrade to H10. And many speculate that the, the reports mm -hmm. um, are true except for one of few things. Now let me just run down the details for you. It's supposed to be running the Snapdragon 835 chipset. 6 gb of RAM, 128 storage. Um, HTC Sense 9 on top of the Android 7 Nougat and the resolution of 1556 by 2550. This resolution is what has persons a bit iffy. Okay. Um, well, that, it, I have no idea what they were ready for for yeah. HTC 11. They, they, they are referencing to the new LG G6. Have you yeah. seen any images I've, of it? I've seen the G6. Right. The LG G6 has, just like the rumored HTC 11, mm -hmm. um, 
has a very unusual resolution. This is because the G6 has no bezel at all. Okay. okay. Yeah, it's bezel less. So if they're going with something similar with that with the large screen, it's possible it could have that resolution, but we're just left to see. Alright, well we'll see what they they the culprit. But I am a bit worried for HC. HC constantly produces great phones, but they have very bad marketing and that has been their their downfall for the past few years. Constantly producing quality quality devices. The camera quite so far sometimes, but good devices all around. But the marketing just not a garbage. We'll see if they could overcome that for the HC 11 and win back some fans. Hopefully, hopefully, yeah. So that's 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 next. Well, 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 that's it. That's it. Yeah. We forgot M. Oh, right, right. Yes. yes. Uh, Mobile World Congress. Mobile World Congress. So the Mobile World Congress is going to take place the end of February, February 27th to March the 2nd. Mm -hmm. At this event, you're going to find a lot of the top phone brands, except Apple, who will be present there um, showcasing their new flagship phones for 2017 mm -hmm. and what products they're currently working on, prototypes and so forth. Yeah. So that is the next big tech um, show, consumer show. So we expect some great things. We're going to see what is up in the tech world again? What, yeah. what, I think that C, CES has been overtaken by, by Mobile World Congress. You yeah. get more of the bigger brands and, uh, announcing their flagship devices That's during right. mm -hmm. MWC. So we'll see what, how the tech space is going to be for, for consumer electronics in the phone space coming in MWC, MWC. MWC yeah. So stay tuned, we'll keep you updated um, every week. We try to bring an episode every week, try to keep it around five minutes. <laughs> uh, do a bad job at that, but it's a lot of information and we're kind of yeah. passionate about this stuff. Definitely. So keep it locked, technoblog.com and yeah, and you can find us on Facebook as well. Yes. Ben Wilkins, Maurice John. Yes, Maurice John on Facebook, Ben Wilkins. Yeah. Alright, so, so have a good day. Have a good day? Yeah. I kind of worried. Yeah. 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 We had to do it like that. We were just like a good thing. Okay. <laughs> and this is Maurice John from Techno Blog. Ben Wilkins, signing off. Alright. <laughs>